Hey guys, so you're given a problem where you have three views drawn at a scale of 2 to 1 in third angle orthographic projection and you're asked to draw an isometric view to a scale of 2 to 1. Start off by drawing in the isometric axes. Two are 30 degrees to the horizontal and the third is 90 degrees to the horizontal. Next, draw in an isometric box in order to construct your isometric circle. Since you're drawing it to a scale of 2 to 1, your radius is 30 millimeters. So that means that your major diameter will be 60 millimeters. This means that your isometric box should be 60 millimeters in length and height with the midpoints at 30 millimeters. Draw the isometric circle construction lines by drawing straight lines from the obtuse corners to the opposite midpoints. The length of the major diameter is drawn from the obtuse corner to the midpoint furthest away from the corner. The length of the minor diameter is drawn from the star-like intersection point to the adjacent midpoints. The depth of the circle is 2 times 12 millimeters, which is 24 millimeters. Measure this depth by extending your center point from the first circle by 24 millimeters along an isometric construction line. Once the extended center point is found, draw in another 60 millimeter isometric box. Draw another isometric circle and join it to the first isometric circle. Now draw the rectangular cutouts by measuring 10 millimeters on either side of the isometric circle center line, resulting in a width of 20 millimeters and 10 millimeters from the top and bottom of the circle to achieve the height of the cutout. Extend the cutout through the depth of the circular section.
Lastly, draw the small protruded isometric circle in. You can use your stencil for this as the major diameter is 10 millimeters. Extend the small circle by drawing an isometric line from the center by four millimeters. Join the two circles. Lastly, neaten up your drawing using an eraser, pencil, eraser shield, set square and French curve. 